Hello again, my friends, and welcome to Season 2, Episode 3 of our co-op survival. And in this video, we are building our storage shed. So we went ahead and laid out the blueprints, and we left an open spot so that way we could have space down there for more storage. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and start laying in some logs. I'm going to cut down some trees so we could have enough. Hey, nice, you caught a bird. <laughs> yeah, dude. All right. Anyway, a lot has changed. If you haven't been watching the live stream, uh, not saying sure or anything, but during that, I set up a whole bunch of log holders and stick holders. So we have a good amount of logs going on. We have about 250 in here, but we need, as you can see, 338. So I'm going to go ahead and grab some logs and just get to it. I'm really excited to have the storage shed set up, though. Yeah, it looks really nice. It looks nice, and we really just need the massive amounts of logs. Yeah. yeah. Like we said before, this season we are going for the most clean-looking base. Probably not out there on YouTube, but, you know, it's going to be a clean base by our standards. Just so it's pleasing for y'all to view. We're definitely stepping up our game. Oh, yes, definitely. Especially after checking out some of y'all's bases. Uh... Some of them put us to shame. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. This is gonna take so long, but thankfully, Om um, literally did do a good amount of farming in the live stream. So that way, we have a whole shit ton of logs, which makes this so much easier on us in this video. Yeah, it does. And it also gives us a great time to interact with y'all. Mm hmm. And, uh,. I mean, that's really important to us, and it makes gathering these logs and stuff that we used to do in between episodes a lot funner. Because yeah. it used to be we'd log on probably two, three hours early, cut and farm everything we need, and then record. So it was just a lot of us sitting in silence, and a lot of the fun talking points we would normally have we already discussed during those two hours. Yeah. So hopefully this is going to lead to, you know, just better videos overall. So yeah, we're planning on doing this one two stories, kind of like our other one, except our other one had a loft. So, yeah, it wasn't a legit two story. It was just, like Sivo said, a loft, and we didn't have too much up there. Mm -hmm. But this one, I want multiple floors of log holders, stick holders, and rock holders. Oh dude, this thing is... All right, maybe not rock holders, but definitely stick and log. Yeah, rock holders, we could... Probably either do at the bottom or just outside. Yeah. Because rock holders think... are nice to have when it comes to building a wall. Yeah. Like, I, I agree it's nice to have, but I think we need them, like, where we're going to build walls. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, just set up a bunch there and have them there in case we ever need to repair the wall. God forbid it gets all messed up. Yeah. So, I wonder if we can convince Lumberjack to uh, to make a stone axe and cut down a tree. Yeah, yeah, that would be <laughs> that would be awesome. That's what I was thinking when I saw the stone axe, and then, like, after watching Lumberjack's um, real-life axe comparison, mm -hmm. I was like, dude, what if he tried it with a stone axe? Yeah. <laughs> that would be That'd insane. That would be great. I'm going to attempt to coerce him. Ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here first. If he does it, all me. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to take some convincing because even with the uh, rusty axe, he was he was getting a bit exhausted with that. Oh, don't worry, I'll give him like a month or two to uh, get back in the swing of things. Yeah, I got stronger in like two minutes. Yeah, but if you want to get stronger in two minutes, just send us nineteen ninety nine and six easy payments, and we'll teach you how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just send you some uh, tutorials and whatnot. It may take about like three months for it to uh, finally arrive at your doorstep, but that's not our fault. That's the mailman's fault. Mm -hmm. And be sure you send it using a PayPal gift feature, so you can't do a chargeback. <laughs> Sorry, no cash on delivery. <laughs> Yeah, no, no <laughs> small text here. <laughs> Man, this is Slammers and have all the small text. I don't know what's gonna say, it's gonna have all the small text. I swear to god, you better put up like a fake phone number up there just across the screen. I was thinking about typing out a big long like paragraph. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's gonna say and I kind of regret saying that I would. So I think I mentioned this before. 
Maybe in the stream. I don't know. But I feel like in a future update, they should add like some shitty scaffolding that you can yes. build with and then take apart and still collect the stuff that you put in there. Mm-hmm. That would be fantastic. Because you could just like literally either build like some stick scaffolding or a log scaffolding and once you're done with it, you could just take it apart because there are some times that, you know, I don't want to use mods and I just want to like get real high on top of a building to lay down some rocks or something. And I just can't because I don't have mods and it's just really hard to get up there unless you actually built uh like a platform which is a waste it's a complete waste of logs yep either a platform or stairs or pretty much everything and anything that cost a shit ton of logs yeah hey it's daytime how did that sleep go that's i totally forgot to sleep oh man the other day the other day before i woke up or not before after i woke up for my interview I like uh, opened up YouTube and saw that you were live streaming, and I opened up literally on that part that that cowman like attacked you, like the second he attacked you. That was hilarious. <laughs> the, the one where it, like <laughs> I jumped off the cliff and it was like flying in the air chasing me. Yeah, <laughs> that shit was terrifying. That was. Oh man! Uh, earlier today, I was actually playing in um like. An RMZ at Cowman and a Virginia all spawned together. Mm -hmm. And somehow I got talked into going over to him and uh, <laughs> just seeing if I could survive. I did. I did. Thankfully, RMZ, uh, I guess he had some beef with Cowman. He just, like, uppercutted that guy's glass jaw and knocked him out. <laughs> oh, no, man. Cowman was sleeping with his wife. <laughs> oh, man. He was gr uh, giving yeah. Virginia that, that pounding, that sweet, sweet belly flop pounding. That is, that's disturbing. <laughs> I wouldn't need, oh god, I'm so glad there's no fan fiction of that yet. I was jumping on top of the cowman, like, uh, after he was dead, and he was jiggling like a 90s waterbed. <laughs> I was having I a blast saw that. just jumping I saw on top that. of like, I, uh, I came in, and I saw you, like, cause he was like a brick. <laughs> I think that was today, right? Yeah, that was today. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty fantastic, I, uh... I, like, scaled down this cliff, and, like, immediately at the bottom, there was, like, this bucket of red paint, and I just put it on, and I was like, oh, yeah, I got some camo to blend into my surroundings. <laughs> <laughs> I was just fucking bright red in, like, a, an open field, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. All right, let's go ahead and push this other card gently over the edge with our patent-pending delivery technique. The petitin. Yeah, that's petitin. Here's her empty one. Thank you. What the hell is this? How am I supposed to retrieve this? Uh, we're only responsible for delivery. Everything after that is the end user's problem. Jesus. I'm on top of the log holders now. <laughs> Thank you for choosing um shipping service. I'm um, shipping service. I hope your logs are as stiff as ours. Oh, Jesus. Alright guys, so it's been about three hours. We finally finished building our new storage shed. As you can see, all the logs we got during the live stream was not nearly enough. <laughs> but uh, on a side note, I was able to finish building my wall over there. So I should be able to furnish that. But let's go ahead and take a look at what Civil was doing while I was chopping trees. Alright. So we went ahead and built it, you know, the rest of it, and it kind of resembles our old uh, storage shed with the loft idea thing. I just, I kind of like the way it looks. So we're definitely having log storage up here, unlike we did in the other one, because the other one we only had stick storage and like bone storage and shit like that. And I went ahead and built a stairway leading down, which looks really nice, to be honest. And we'll have some more storage down here, so that way whenever we, like, decide to build on that island, it'll be more easier to, you know, you know, just lay down the blueprints and carry some logs from there, build the bridge, you know, just push some log carts yeah, over. Yeah, quality of life things. Yeah. Just to make everything simpler, but look at it. It looks amazing. 
Yes. Like yes, especially from this angle. And we have a nice little defensive gate for a door. And it, it just adds to the, the character of this building. But uh we're gonna go ahead and like furnish this during a live stream. I don't know when that'll be, probably Saturday. Because we have an update coming out, but for y'all it'll already be uploaded and done. Yeah. But uh that's pretty much it guys. I'd like to thank y'all for watching. We really do appreciate it. Like the video if you liked it, maybe get subscribed and uh we'll catch y'all next time. Peace out.